I was 45 years old when we moved over here and started farming. So in the early 2000s, Dwight Alt and Dave Surfling and some others were raising pigs for Nyman and we said, well, that would be a way to, uh, to, to go. And so that's when we got into it. And then we liked it because of, of it fit in with uh, sustainable type farming and smaller type farming. I came back to start farming uh, in 2011, the end of 2011. One of the big reasons why I was able to come back and start farming was Nyman Ranch. When I think of the alternatives of raising pork another way, um, that's when I really appreciate Nyman Ranch and what we're doing. Our pigs can move, they can run around, they're in deep straw, they have access to go inside and outside, and they have natural light. The ability to farm in, in a sustainable way, raise pigs in a way that, that fits with our whole system that we're trying to do on our farm, it's given us an opportunity and a company where we can work with, where we still own the pigs, we still, it's, it's our business from our perspective is trying to make a, a system work on a farm, an entire system. So the crops, your rotations to have the livestock, the diversity that you need, try to produce as much as you can on farm, as close to nature as possible. Uh, I think an important aspect that we try to do here on this farm for sustainability is utilizing the manure, rotations and everything else where we'll have uh, the crop that we have preceding the crop. So like behind us you'll see the corn. The only input that we had on there was our own on-farm manure. That's the only thing we put on there. We didn't do anything else to that and it's a beautiful corn crop and but what that does for for soil health and to improve the profitability of that land is to utilize everything that we can with the diversification on our farm. We as a family are all working together to try to make this farm sustainable and um, you know we've got different generations that are all working here at the same time and heading down that goal. It's continually evolving and we have to continually look at the future of how we can make this a sustainable system and a, and a sustainable food system for this country that's going to last for years and years to come. <music>